and we bring ourselves over to our chart that I have not been over here in a while. This is the OG Safe Moon chart, and I can see that the uh, the technical analysis that we had done of this this pattern and this losing its pattern. You know, we had this here, um, right there. Oops, grabbed the whole wrong thing. This line, you know, this this was this was our last touch here, to the top of the uh, top of there to the bottom of the trend line. You bring it out, and that's what our target was right here at the bottom, which was what is this uh, five one one four? We held that floor for a while, as you can see. There's some confluence right here. It was trying to hold on this line. This was the last. This is the the all time high that it had made before it went out into this huge bull run. And um, now it's starting to lose it. You can see that now it's holding right here on this uh, 2618 target that we had. This is basically the full move down. Um, if you look at it on the longer time period, I wonder if I were to, um, let's see. Gib, 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 gib. Kind of get rid of all this stuff now, right? Oops. Actually, I don't really need that anymore, actually. All right, let's see, boys and ladies. You do your Fibonacci from the top here. You could do it from here to here. Eh, not really, though. You'd have to do it from this high right here to this low. Well, yep, that seems about right. So I'll do this. The bottom, which is basically zero where it started. Um, go to right here. Now yeah, I got some wicks above, so we can see what's going on here. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, so okay, so it came for support on the two, three, six here, but it looks like if it loses that, I mean it's pretty much null and back to um, grinding town, which was down here in this region, which I'm sure if we were to do a reverse, an inverse fib on this region, we could, um, let's see, inverse fib, we could see what it's doing. Um, looking in closely, looking in closely, uh, it's pushing. It's pushing towards the 786 at the moment. So you realistically, you need to re reverse back down and lose that. Because if you go onto the uh, invert scale here, you would want you to lose this 786 and actually get rejected back down to the 382 to the 236 region. That's what typically it's going to happen out here. And this is actually a what kind of structure are we looking at here? I mean, it would be sort of a flag. Would have, would have, it would have looked like this on a shorter time period like that. So it could actually be breaking to the downside still because this is a pennant out of a um, uptrend because technically this is an uptrend on the inverse and the target is uh, the 1618 at 1054. So if we go back to the inverse and bring it back, you can see that it is down there to that 1054. But if it were to break back up, you'd be seeing it come around that 1976 region. Remember, none of this is financial advice. This is for entertainment purposes only. Please do all of your own research when getting into a token. You guys know this. Never invest money you're willing, you're not willing to lose, you know. And definitely, definitely, like I just said, do your own research. Have a good one, everybody. Thanks for watching the video. Have a good morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are, and I will see you on the next video.